China has sent warplanes over the disputed East China Sea airspace, which it announced as a defense zone last week. The move has upped the stakes after Japan, South Korea and the U.S. flew through the zone in defiance of China's demand that all flight plans over the area must first be submitted to them or face defensive measures. The foreign minister responded to U.S. claims that China is upsetting the status quo by asking Japan and the United States to reflect on themselves and stop making irresponsible accusations against China. He continued by calling on them to stop creating friction and put an end to statements that may harm regional stability. The new air defense zone covers the islands known as Senkaku in Japan and Diaoyu in China, and also claimed by South Korea and Taiwan. The dispute is the latest escalation in tensions in recent months. U.S. Vice President Joe Biden will be hoping to smooth over relations when he visits the region next week.